Hey folks, this is HP and it's Dr. Pink and today we talk about the Blue Jean Blues as played by uh, Jeff Healy, uh, CZ Top and another guy which I forgot. And um, I've chosen the Jeff Healy version because I really uh, adore the playing of Jeff Healy, even uh, Jeff Healy he used to play like this. <laughs> Oops, I cannot do it. I can do it, <laughs> but we do it in normal playing mode. And uh, first, I'm gonna play it for you that you see how it works. Uh, we basically just check out how it's played, the uh, the pattern of it, and a few ideas. And yep, that's how it sounds. <laughs> few things to know first um, the main problem in this track or in this song is the form even it is a pretty normal 12 bar minor blues it doesn't seems to be like one because when you listen through it um, the lyrics seem to start somewhere else than the soloing and um, the best thing to really uh, do it exactly the way it's meant to be just listen to the versions exactly and uh, in combination with the lyrics but when it comes to the guitar playing part it's more or less the basic form uh, which I'm going to show now and in combination with some fill-ins the Jeff Healy version is in A minor the CZ Top version is in B minor um, B minor will be two, two frets above but we're going to check out the Jeff Healy version and so let's get started. The chords are displayed below in the description and um, <coughs> first four bars are A minor. And the A minor part works a little bit like this, <laughs> a little bit exactly like this. <laughs> yep, yeah, it's this one here. We have uh, sliding up here, we got one, two, three, four, so we slide here from F5, first fret, third fret, to F5, to a G5, to A5. So three, three, four, and one, and then two. We make a so short chord, short chord here, A minor in the fifth fret, which is the upper part of an A minor seven chord. Three. Slide up here in the fifth fret on the through count of three, three and back. Slide up and back to that one. one. So one, two, three and and then we go back down here and th the thing comes again. Let's see it with the backing track. So one, two, three. Now on the this is now the 
Jeff Healy and CZ Top are playing in a trio formation, meaning we're going to have drum and bass. Now, so meaning now we play fill ins in between this stuff, like uh, this. So we play the first chord, and instead of doing this figure, we do this lick here. Easy one. Seventh fret, we play A minor pentatonics here. Then Jeff Feely makes a little bit more complicated figure there. We make an easier one here because <laughs> I want that you can play too. <laughs> we do this one here. His is basically that one as well, but a little bit more complicated. Um, third part, we do this here. Bending in seventh, then make a bar here. And we can do this. See? And then pull off eight to five. And it's a bit, since this is a shuffle blues, we're playing a sextal. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three. This is the tempo. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. And then the figure is finished. See? And then we have enough space to go back to the figure. Yeah, so the first part is like this. to the Jeff Healy version. Um, it sounds nearly like Jimi Hendrix chord, but this will be this one here. So this one is this one here. It's a little bit hard to grab, but it's a nice one. Um, probably he's only doing the upper part, but I would do the full part because in the trio formation, otherwise it's too empty. So grab here, fifth fret, Third fret, fifth pink in the sixth. Fifth, third, fifth, sixth. And then jump in this figure here from five, six. Slide up two bars. So, so. And then comes this figure again. have time for a slight fill in here. I did this one in. This one here. figure. And then you can do any kind of fillings now. Two bars again, A minor. And then we come to the ending, and then now comes the Jimi Hendrix chord. Seven, six, seven, eight, E seven sharp nine. For one bar, again, seven, six, seven, eight. can do the rhythm like this. And then the bass. And then, the and then the bass with the pick. Like this. And 
now comes a special turnaround. I never heard l something like that be in another tune that goes like this. <laughs> again so we do a five again and then the form is more or less finished <laughs> comes to the soloing in a trio formation that's a little bit tricky that would be another tutorial here but uh, when you go to into soloing um, the main tip I can give to you is don't be afraid of emptiness <laughs> even um, uh, as on the Jeff Healy version uh, he plays a lot of stuff there which doesn't really let you feel the emptiness but um, since we all cannot play, probably c probably all, most of you cannot play that in that speed and that virtuosity, um, the trick is to um, <laughs> don't be afraid of the emptiness. <laughs> tutorial uh, on a minor blues soloing the, I think there's one uh, I have one is called amazing minor blues licks probably check that one out for some ideas yeah but this was the blue jean blues uh, by me and dr. pink <laughs> and um, enjoy it and put on your blue jeans <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>